super, super, super excited to share this video with you. Um, if, you start, if you've been watching my videos, uh, you've noticed I keep talking about macros and how important it is to have you know, a certain amount of protein per day and the cleanest, leanest protein possibly that you can get. Um, it's tough. Everybody lives in a different uh, location around the world. Some people have other options uh, that other people don't. So I have tried every single one of these. Uh, and today it's going to be canned tuna, a super, super clean, uh, super convenient way to get, you know, close to 30, uh, 30 grams of protein per serving, okay? And what I did was, I've tried every single one of these, and as of a week ago, I found the best option for canned tuna. So these are five different sources, five different kinds, uh, two different companies. Okay, they all have different macros, though. So I'm going to start from, um, I mean, they're all great products. I mean, these are, these are high premium uh, canned tunas. These are the only ones that I've found, um, you know, that have, you know, certain macros where you're going to get 30 grams of protein or more. Um, you know, they've got, there's, you know, the options out there, Bumblebee, there's a lot less uh, cheaper brands out there, but uh, it's, it, it's, you know, typically the cheaper food, you know, the cheaper macros and the less quality of food. You know, here on this channel or here on these videos, I'm going to, you know, search and search and search and search and find the best options for whatever it is uh, that I'm looking for. So let's go ahead and begin. Uh, again, all of these, these, these are awesome products. They're all from two different companies. Either, either, either any one of these will work, um, but I'm going to go from my least to my favorite. So the first one, this is Wild Planet. Very, very good tuna. Uh, you know, I thought, you know, until of last week, this was the best tuna out there. This is from Wild Planet. It's a uh, uh, sustainably uh, pole and line cot. It's wild skipjack light tuna, okay? It's got 100 pure tuna and salt, no liquids added, okay? It said and salt, so that means it's going to be high in sodium. You know, sodium, you know, in my opinion, the less sodium you have, the better. You know, you retain water. Um, you know, and you just really got to watch it. So, um, so we're going to start off here. I'm going to show you right here. It's a wild plant, wild skipjack, light tuna. Great product. Uh, tastes delicious. Great company. Let's start with the macros. Okay, 14 grams of protein per serving. Two and a half grams, uh, or two and a half servings per uh, can. So that, that's going to be 14. It's going to be 28 and 7. 35 grams of protein right here. You know, I eat my tuna in a plastic bowl. Maybe I'll add some olives. Maybe I'll add um, a little bit of salt, depending on what the macros is. Um, maybe I'll chop up some pickles. Um, and then the, the best product, and I don't think I have it, uh, and, and I'll share it. I'll share it in the next video. A lot of people like to put mayo, mayonnaise. Um, I put uh, this product. It's called avocado mayo but it's not mayo, and it's made out of just avocados. I believe there's maybe even, maybe two or three ingredients, and it's, it's made by Primal Kitchen, and I will do a review just on that mayonnaise um, alone. So I put about a tablespoon to a tablespoon and a half uh, in my tuna, and again, you can add a little, little bit of other ingredients, but typically I just have, sometimes I'll just have tuna in the Primal Kitchen, uh, avocado mayo, and that's it, and you're going to get 35 grams of protein. Awesome, awesome, awesome uh, meal uh, just to get your protein in, and it doesn't taste bad. So this is a good one, 35 grams of protein. The reason why I don't suggest this one over the others that I'm going to show you is it's got 200 milligrams of sodium per serving. So this is close to 600 milligrams of sodium, which is extremely, extremely high. But again, you know, if you like the taste, if you like the salt taste of it, this is great. Uh, we'll go, I believe this is uh, the second one. Now, this is the same brand, okay? The only difference is, is this is, uh, let's see, no liquids added, wild albacore. This is, okay, so this is wild uh, albacore tuna, same company, versus the wild skipjack. This is the one I just did, and this is wild albacore tuna, okay? And I believe the macros, it does, it does have salt in it, so it's pretty much, it's got 100% uh, pure, there's nothing, no additives, anything, except for the salt. Same thing with this one. 
but it's a different kind of tuna. So um, 13 grams of protein, so 26, we're gonna look about a gram or two less than protein, um, and the sodium is the same. So these are actually very similar, uh, very similar macros. This one has about two or three grams more protein. It's just a different kind of tuna. Um, I've had both of these. Um, they taste the same. Uh, you know, the wild skipjack light tuna to the wild albacore tuna. This one might have a little bit more saturated fat. Let's see. Total fat, 3.5. That's what it is. This wild albacore tuna has uh, 3.5 grams of total fat times two and a half. So you're looking at about nine grams of total fat versus we've got 0.5 grams. So 1.5 grams of fat, that's why it's light tuna. So if you're trying to uh, you know, hone in on uh, less fat, the wild skipjack tuna is better. Um, if you, know, you really don't care, the albacore tuna is good. Both great product, products, just extremely high in sodium. Now I found this brand, this Crown Prince. Check these out. I think these are, these are all different, but it's the same brand and they're about the same price as this Wild Planet, and in some cases, it's a little bit cheaper. So check these out. That's the brand. And this, I mean, if you guys have any recommendations, if you know of any other brand canned tuna uh, that, that uh, tastes as good and has better macros, please let me know. I'll check it out because, you know, these are lifesavers uh, throughout the day uh, just to get, you know, your proper protein in. So we're going to go with... Uh, the Tongle tuna, we've got Tongle tuna, we've got albacore tuna, and then we've got uh, albacore tuna with no salt added. So the Tonga tuna, right here, this one has 15 grams of protein, and two, so it's 28 grams of protein, similar to that, a little bit less. Um, the sodium on this, however, um, I believe is a lot less. 160 milligrams of tuna uh, times two, so you know, you've reduced your sodium by half. Okay, and that's huge for me. Uh, zero grams fat, all right? Uh, so this would be the third selection, uh, the third, my third favorite. Here's my second favorite. This is the solid white albacore tuna in spring water. Uh, in spring water, so I believe there is some salt in here. Uh, so check that out. That's my second favorite. Okay, so this has 16 grams of protein times two. So this is, yeah, I mean, this is 32 grams of protein. So this is the second highest in protein. Um, we've got uh, sodium, 105 milligrams times two. So uh, just a little bit above 200 grams of sodium and zero total fat. So this one is my second favorite. This is the albacore solid white in spring water. Boom. Okay, so my very favorite, taste-wise, Macro-wise, this is the Crown Prince, solid white, no salt added, albacore tuna in spring water. Check that out. This is the premium tuna, tastes the best. It's, it, it's a price comparison to the other four that I showed you, and the macros-wise, it's just, it's just an all-star. So, we've got 14 grams of, tuna, of, of tuna, 14 grams of protein times two, so close to 30 grams of protein, a little bit on the left side, and it has 30 milligrams of sodium times two, so, so way less, about 60 milligrams of sodium. So for sodium, this is by far the best. You get your protein, you get close to 30 grams and only 60 milligrams of sodium. This, this is delicious. This is the albacore tuna. And again, you can get real creative with tuna. You can eat it right out of the can. You can add a little bit of mayo. I mean, you can you do whatever you want with it. And it's a perfect, perfect, perfect lean protein. Um, so this is just a review on the, on the canned tuna options that I have found. If you have any other uh, recommendations and you found a tuna that is very similar to the one, uh, my favorite one that I found, uh, the, uh, the Crown Prince, uh, b both of these, um, I know you can get the Wild Planet at Costco. Um, I think traditionally, you know, at the Walmarts and the Fries and all those, I don't think they carry these premium tunas. I could be wrong, but I'm almost certain, you know, they carry the Bumblebee and you know, all the other, you know, less quality brands. But again, please reach out to me. If you, if you know of a better uh, product than the Crown Prince Albacore Tuna, you know, uh, please let me know. So hopefully you guys like this review. Um, I was really excited about this because um, once I found that all five of these are premium products, you break it down to the macros and you really want, uh, you know, the best taste the best macros, the leanest protein, and overall the best product. And that's what I'm here to do, is to do that research, um, to try it on my own, and to share it with you. So 
Hope you guys like this video, and I will see you guys very, very soon. Peace.